Hi folks, Puffin here with your Antifa News Brief for September, sorry, October 3rd, 2021. Uh, it should have happened back in September, it should have happened back in August or August of last year or years ago. Rudy Giuliani may be flipping on Trump. I just got this from a YouTuber, and I'm sorry I don't have his name, but uh, first time me seeing this YouTuber's channel, so I'll uh, hopefully watch it again, a leftist YouTuber, so yay, I've <laughs> only seen a few of those, thanks to YouTube's algorithm keeping us all apart, but now that I've discovered him, I'll watch him again and mention him in a future video. I'd like to clout chase him now, because he's got 127,000 views on this video already, in 23 hours, or something like that, uh, maybe 127,000 subscribers, something like that, more than me. Um, Check out my song Clout Chaser, though, on my channel. Uh, anyway, he's mentioning that experts are saying Rudy Giuliani will probably flip on Trump. Again, should have happened a long time ago. Don't know if Rudy Giuliani can get the same Michael Cohen effect that he becomes a hero that everybody loves to see, despite whatever he did wrong before, because he got caught, and even though he took getting caught to flip on Trump, he did flip on Trump. And so, in a way, we can be forgiving no matter how far you've gone, if you're turning over the person who's still doing worse and going worse. So yeah, Rudy Giuliani, you could be America's mayor again. You could be, you know, somebody we care about um, instead of, you know, just somebody most of us hate. So, and your life's gone completely downhill. Apparently Trump never paid you. You've been disbarred and now they're coming after you with charges. So yeah, you should flip on Trump and Trump should flip on Putin. Um, I don't know if Putin has anybody to flip on, the devil, but you know, the oil companies. But the point is, we can tell who's been running this. I'm going to make another video about he who wears the crown, heavy is the head. But Giuliani's time is up. Like, he's at the end of his story here. Trump never paid him. Trump let him get disbarred. Putin didn't even pay him. He's, you know, begging for money, apparently. And Putin's not even finding some back channel to send him some money on. Is it because Putin's broke? Is it because they're cutting this guy off? Well, think about it, Trump. If they're cutting Rudy Giuliani off, they're cutting you off. You're next. Like, Putin doesn't care how many American heroes he can trash and take down. If he can make a hero of you and then take you down, he doesn't care. He wants to destroy America. If Trump represents America to you, he can destroy Trump and destroy America that way. That's kind of his agenda, but more on that in the next video. Giuliani, like you can see other videos I've made about he might be Jaden X's boyfriend. Uh, Jaden X is the guy who stormed the Capitol with the Trumpers and filmed Ashley Babbitt getting killed. See my uh, my rap song, Regulators, Jaden X verse about him. Also see the verses about Marjorie Taylor Greene and Lauren Boebert. So far, I might have to make a Regulators verse specifically for Rudy Giuliani. The reason I think they're dating is because Rudy Giuliani made a whole video about Jaden X's tweets and this whole fabricated story to try to make him Antifa. And he's not Antifa. Jaden X is a Trumper. He's an insurrectionist, a Trump insurrectionist. And he's the one who plays a leftist on YT, on YouTube, to give us a bad name. Kind of like the, the Boston shooter the day after, or the, later in the day after the El Paso KKK shooter shot people in Texas. The, they activated, the KKK activated a Boston shooter who they had make some fake leftist post to make a leftist shooter to balance it out. That's how evil they are. Are they evil enough that they're bombing them, that, they, you know, that the Trumper terrorists are running both the Taliban, because Putin is running the Taliban, and, you know, Trump is obviously helping the Taliban by handing them the country, and running the uh, ISIS terrorists, bombing the Taliban today and at the Taliban leader's mom's funeral, killing Taliban? Are they playing both sides? Yeah, that's what they do. Don't get played by evil. Don't get played by Trumpers. So, yeah. They're playing both sides with Jaden X as a supposed leftist and Rudy Giuliani as an obvious Trumper. And Rudy Giuliani is trying to tell people that Jaden X is an is a Antifa activist or a BLM activist. And Jaden X is trying to tell people, you know, Rudy Giuliani is... Well, he doesn't really say anything against Rudy Giuliani, honestly. They're just giving each other attention and coverage. I'm giving them both attention and coverage now because I think people need to have some attention, some process, some due process enforced on these people. Jaden X has been taken in, John Sullivan has been taken in by the FBI, but then released by a judge in Utah. Maybe that judge should be looked into for their Trumpiness. So maybe those FBI agents should be looked into for their Trumpiness. So this gets bigger and the net is both expanding and being drawn in. And if Rudy Giuliani flips, that's a big point to arresting Trump. But again, as all the evidence rounds up, 
Joe Biden's going to have to either arrest Trump or the people are going to do it. They're going to grab him by the posse. Hashtag grab him by the posse. It's beyond their control now. So these people who like to be in control and think they can be in control through, you know, some whatever, some, you know, switching people around. No, you don't, you don't get away with it. The people don't let you get away with it. So Rudy Giuliani is not going to get away with it. The wise thing for him to do is to beg America's mercy, beg the world's mercy, and hope to be redeemed by flipping on Trump a la Michael Cohen. Because people do love Michael Cohen now, and they forgive him, and they appreciate him turning on the evil. So, meaning betraying the evil. Turn off the evil, betray Trump, betray evil, and come back to America. So please, Rudy Giuliani, as much as I've spent time hating you, I would rather like you as a kindly old man who turned on Trump. So go ahead and do it. There's nothing in it for you to stick with Trump now. He's not bailing you out. Putin's not bailing you out. No one's bailing you out. You're just going to spend your life in jail. Or you can turn on Trump and become a hero. So do it. Uh, let's get Trump out of here. And we don't have to bother grabbing him by the posse. Let's let the wheels of justice take care of it. But go ahead and do that so other people don't think they can get away with this stuff. And so the world knows that the people's choice, democracy, is coming and will oppose and get rid of tyrants. I heard Duterte quit politics yesterday. Will we be able to elect a better president in the Philippines who will turn Duterte over to the International Criminal Court? These are... The same questions for America. Did we elect someone good enough in America to turn Trump over to the International Criminal Court or wherever you can turn him over to, turn him, in, turn him into jail? We'll see. But uh, it'll start with Rudy Giuliani. We got a test case now. So arrest Rudy and let's finish this. Let's wrap up the fascists in America because it's going to shrink real fast once you start to actually have the consequences they deserve for the people who have been doing this to us. Thanks for watching.